Hi guys, Ben here. It's the last away day of the season in the Premier League. Um, we've come a long way and we're going to finish it off with this lovely, lovely summer's day in London. Um, just walking to the tube station now. Uh, the rumours of the team are that Trent plays in midfield and that Klein plays, which I'm okay with. Um, as long as there's not too many changes other than that. Um, and we can get the point that can skirt up for and I'm very, very happy. But what a lovely day. Um, just finally got to wear shorts for probably the first time this season. Um, it, was, it was raining in, well, it was raining in Porto. It was wasn't particularly nice in, in, in Rome on the on, on the day of the game, but this today is beautiful. It's a Sunday afternoon, uh, four thirty kickoff, and uh, the Reds can score Champions League football, and yeah, it's exciting. <laughs> The worst result possible, 1-0 uh, defeat there. Um, we had a better team for the first half an hour, I thought. Um, controlling the game, getting some good chances. Mane with a couple of efforts, a quartile was equal to. And then a pretty soft goal, to be honest, from Giroud. Um, 
You know, Moses giving too much pace. Well, Moses is one of their best players all, all afternoon. Um, guess crossing his left foot, Giroud's free. I'm not sure why Klein isn't tucking in. I'm not sure why Van Dijk is, you know, not marking either man. Lovren's on two there. Um, frustrating, and then we never get going after that. We never really get going. Slanky comes on, has a couple of half chances. Never looks like scoring a goal. I'm sorry. Um, as soon as he came on, I kind of accepted the defeat. It's maybe a psychological thing rather than me having to go at him, but um, that's the way it was. We were too slow all day after the, after they went one up. Um, so yeah, in a Byron Burger now, and uh, you know, drowning the sorrows. But um, yeah, I'll, I'll round it up later on. So I'm back at the flat now, absolutely shattered. Um, this bank holiday weekend has really catched up with me. God, the state of my flat, I don't really want you to see that. Um, yeah, the Reds are defeated again. It's another poor performance. That's with the exception of the Roma 5-2. Um, it's been four or five on the trot. Ugh, poor performances now. Um, obviously burnout's a factor. Obviously injuries are a factor. Obviously the fact we have been prioritizing to an extent the Champions League run is a big factor, obviously. Yeah, um, that, that's that time of the season where you're not going to be great every single week. We need a, we need a bigger squad, we need more quality um, going through the squad to be able to deal with um, this type of schedule. Because we, we, we want to be at this end of the season um, still competing for trophies. And, you know, if we keep sort of limping over the line, as I've said, um, then we're going to have difficulty doing that. Um, just watching El Clasico now, and apparently Ronaldo went off injured at halftime. So I mean, that's uh, that's interesting. But you know, I'm sure I'm sure he'll make the final because it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Um, individual performances today. Uh, Carius was all right, I suppose. I mean, Chelsea, uh, bar the goal, didn't have an awful lot of joy. Didn't really test Carius much at all. I thought both fullbacks struggled. Um, Trent and no, sorry, Klein and uh, Robertson, and then Trent as well. Um, I thought Trent was poor in midfield, and then couldn't really his delivery from fullback was poor as well. Um, centre backs were okay. Lovren didn't seem to win much in the air. Giroud gave him a pretty a tough time. Um, Van Alden was okay, I suppose. Not 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 as good as we've seen from him recently. Milner was a bit leggy as well. We really miss Henderson's composure and um, you know, leadership on that pitch. Uh, and the front three, I just didn't get going for any of them. I thought Firmino and Manny had a good first half an hour um, until the Chelsea goal, which really, really stopped the momentum. Um, and Salah struggled all day, and you know, it's three games without a goal. People starting to jump to conclusions about that. I wouldn't worry too much. He'll be fine for the final. Everyone will be fine for the final. But as far as Lee's concerned, we have to now go and beat Brighton. Um, it's a very similar situation to last year when we had to play Middlesbrough on the final day. Um, you know, I'm sure, I'm sure we'll be okay against them. You know, we've got a week's rest now. Um, you know, refocus, and yeah, we, we and we we know it's make or break. So, um, I'm still confident that we'll be fine. Just really poor today. Really disappointed today. The fans are really good though. I thought the away end was in good spirits um, before the game and during the, the, the new song, the new. Uh, the new song about uh, taking over Rome, great, love that. We're going to be singing that in Kiev, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, let's not get too downbeat about today. I, I, I know I feel like I'm saying this a lot over the past few weeks after West Brom and Stoke. Um, but it is what it is. We're still in the top four, it's still on our own hands. We still have a Champions League final to look forward to, so perspective is important here. Um, yeah, so yeah, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook. And I'll see you next time.